uh, from my knowledge of Marietta living uh, in that time, or living there during my time, Boca is a Shulk player. Uh, one of the few Shulk players in Georgia that, you know, consistently stick with the character. I know there's a couple others, but they just really don't attend or, you know, don't play. And uh, Foxy Grandpa, pretty sure he's going to play Ness. That's what I know him from. And, uh... I'm good. I'm chill. Okay, okay. Yeah, so it's going to be a Shulk Ness. I, I want to say it's bad for Ness. I mean, wouldn't that make sense? Yo, what's up, Dinky? What you got to say? I just got to say that I hope both these players have a fun time. And they the only problem with this game is that both players cannot win. You heard it here from Dinky himself, the Sonic Slayer, the Corrin Extraordinary. <laughs> I mean, you played it well. You know, no, you're, every you're time playing I play against, every time, the Sonic matchup for any character is just like a constant anxiety attack. Yeah. If you want to explain to people who don't have anxiety disorders what it feels like to have an anxiety attack, just make them play Sonic and have to time them out. I agree. I do not enjoy fighting Sonic. Don't know who enjoys fighting Sonic unless you're a Sonic main, but uh, yeah, you did good. I'm happy because I didn't fuck everything up and didn't choke. Yeah, bad. you get to move on to round two. And lose to Cola. Oh, Cola? Oh, yeah. nice. Good luck. Uh, you got it, man. I I'm going to take, hopefully I get him 100%. Yeah, I mean. The thing with playing top players, because I, I know I'm not going to win, is that I just can see how good people are at this game. Yeah. Like, I played Hyper Kirby on Thursday. He did like 82 in one combo. Yeah. I didn't know Roy could do that. Got a DI out, man. That, that's, that's, uh, I just gave up. That's a roll of thumb against Roy, for sure. Like, no, it's yeah, I just want to see this shit. Oh, yeah. Oh, bet. You gonna commentate with me? For a little bit, sure. All right, bet. You don't have to tell me Tennessee sucks. I already know. <laughs> Tennessee does suck. I watch them every weekend. But this is Georgia, baby. We got two Georgia competitors. Well, actually, Foxy Grandpa's, like, kind of from Alabama, I think. He's, he's, he's Georgian where it matters. Okay. And his soul. Bet, bet, bet. And we're gonna get a matchup that I'm not too sure about. You this know. looks like pain for uh, Ness. Yeah. Because... Ness loses to every sword. I I agree to an extent. Maybe not every sword. But as with a lot of the hard sorting matchups, Ness has to push his advantage. For sure. And neither of them have had swords in, so they're hearing us mid-set coach. <laughs> yeah. It's hard to, like, speak loud, but not mid-set coach. <laughs> All right. So far, Foxy Grandpa has really uh, abated these uh, yeah. edge... Uh, ledge, uh, what are they He's called? Getting killed by his big, fat sword. Yeah, edge guards. That's what I was trying to say. The worst thing about Shulk, or the best thing, is that his dish toys are just gigantic. Yeah. So he doesn't really have to, I don't want to know to order them to try super hard to kill you off stage. Pretty much. And they last really long. Uh, I'm starting to do a Shulk hatred. <laughs> yeah, I know. Yeah, it's definitely looking difficult right now. Already 68%. That buster mode is actually insane. Yeah, it's his character's nuts. <laughs> yeah. But Ness is certainly an underrated character. Oh, All right. Looks like I think he's got a dip. Got to play uh, and possibly lose against Cola. Oh. Okay, that was kind of smart on Mocha's part, you know, going for that risky edge guard and uh, kind of getting bailed out by Foxy Grandpa. It's either they both lose the stock or, you know, wow. Okay, so it didn't even matter. Maybe, you know, in hindsight, you know, in hindsight, that's everything. But Mocha looking nice right now. Just going to play the patient game. No need for him to approach. Uh, especially with Ness's, you know, stubby hitboxes. It's going to be really difficult for uh, Mocha to lose this one, I feel. Okay, that was a really great stall right there. Mocha getting caught off guard uh, just for a second. But now in control once again. Oh, speak, of, speak too soon. Ooh, okay. I was like, where's he going, man? But you can just change that uh, momentum real easily with uh, side B. Oh my gosh, so much pressure exerted right now. Great air dodge. Always timing those perfectly against uh, against Mocha right now. Getting caught off guard. But it doesn't really matter, man. He's just playing so solid, playing so safe. Not sure how Ness, you know, is able to deal with this. And as Dinky said before he left, you know, edge guards are everything. Getting Shulk in that terrible, like, perilous position of just having to upbeat. Yeah, that's super dead. Okay, so, you know, it was looking kind of hopeless. And then Foxy Grandpa brings it all the way back. Oh, Smash Minato. Oh, oh, God. I was, like, scared even at zero. Jesus Christ, get out of this. 
if, if I could coach, I would tell Mocha, do not use Smash Monado right now because that is the ticket to lose. All right, 153, you know, a lot of percent right now, and, you know, many things are going to kill. But Foxy Grandpa is playing so safe. Yeah, there you go. The scoop, the loop into the stock loss. Foxy Grandpa is going to go down after making a really strong comeback. I was really impressed. I didn't think he had it in him, but he kept his composure. Um, and game 2 is going to be real interesting because now it's going to be on his counter pick. Unfortunately, Game 3 will probably be, if Game 3 happens, it will be on Mocha's. It's two bands, by the way. It's two bands. Oh, what's up? What's up? Ready for some commentary? Okay. You can just minimize that. All right. So game one, Mocha, you know, uh, he's a stroke player and Foxy Grandpa's a Ness. Okay, okay. And Mocha took it game one after Foxy Grandpa made a pretty strong comeback. Okay, I'm, I really do enjoy watching high level strokes, the Monado combos, the way they adapt to different matchups is very interesting to watch. So Definitely. we'll see how this goes, goes down. Alright, right now, gonna go on Kalos, an interesting counter pick, a lot more space to work with. You're not just gonna get sent off stage into death because, you know, he can let trap you forever. Yeah, I think uh, that's a better stage pick for Schultz. Uh, Schultz can definitely get more uh, vertical execution compared to uh, Ness, who requires back throw a lot of the time. Yeah, I agree. Both players quite even so far. Yeah, definitely even. Despite the big disjoint that Shulk has. Uh, using the shield to get the back to the neutral. Alright, Foxy Grandpa. Oh, that's big shield pressure right there. Oh, yep. to, couldn't hold it long enough. Yeah, that's just a bad situation overall. You try to roll, you're going to get hit anyways. And, yeah. I mean, good shield pressuring from Foxy Grandpa to execute that kill. Oh, yeah, definitely. Oh, okay, I getting to do it again, but a good back air to send him back down. And yeah. a good fair. Yeah, just run off air, you know, that was a bad situation for Foxy Grandpa. It's gonna be really hard for him to react to that. Ooh, that speed is kind of not doing him that much favors right now. It's taking a lot of percentage. Definitely. Foxy Try Grandpa just wants to take it a little slow, get the trade. Yup. Forcing your way in is gonna be kind of difficult against uh, Foxy Grandpa on this stage. Ooh, that's a lot of damage. Here we go. Using that side B, kind of risky, but at that point, you know, Foxy Grandpa already committed to up smash. Uh-oh. Oh, the jump. Monado is going to be a very big asset. And it's, oh, oh my good carry goodness. across the stage. There you Fuck. go. Wow. Cross country right there. Mocha is making a major comeback, but a back throw still living. Okay, great recovery right there. I thought he was going to commit to up B, but, you know, he didn't want to get uh, yo-yoed. Okay, jump coming out. And you're gonna see more aerials. Alright, oh wow. Okay. The eye control from Mocha to keep on living. Yeah, it sent him into the stage, so that was bullshit oh, for him. Wow. wow. Barely getting bailed out. Ooh, the trigger finger on that. Oh yeah. Let's see how how much Shulk can get out of this though. Ooh, that's a good there. It's a fair. It's a fair. Oh, oh my god. Team. Oh, he, didn't, no, he didn't die! No. Oh, Foxy Grandpa's too low! And oh, he couldn't hit the okay. stage! Okay. Oh, no. You hate to see it. Mocha went all in right there. I, he, I guess he got the jump. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That, that, those aerial combos had so much sauce, though. So I know. much sauce. Oh, delicious. Tremendous. I love it. Yeah, that was a great.